We're back with Johnny Question of the Week. I'm Michael. I'm Ravi, and you're watching Season 3, Episode 1. Let's, Let's get, get it. it. Alright, introduce yourself to the camera. I'm Dawson Van Meter, uh, D-line number 53. Yes sir, we got the fresh meets here. So, first aid camp, who is the most intimidating person? It could be player, coach, anybody, off the top. Uh, probably this guy. Mike Wozniak, big scary dude. Freshman though, introduce yourself, what's your name? Uh, I'm Ben Dahl from Rogers, number 46, freshman. Yes, yes sir, yes sir. So, first day at camp, who was the most intimidating person that you saw? It could be player, coach, anybody. Probably Octavius. Octavius. Looks, like, looks like a scary dude off the bed. Oh yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Alright, we got Dom Nussmeyer, part two. Isaac <laughs> here. Uh, what was, or who was the most intimidating person on the football team coming in as a freshman? Probably Moline. He had a big red chopped beard and looked pretty crazy. Was the uh, was the height a problem for you too? Or? <laughs> All right, sounds good. All right, so we got the kicker here. Yeah. All right, uh, we're gonna, we're asking freshman who is the most intimidating uh, football player or coach coming in as your first day of camp. Um, probably the D lineman. Who's the guy that had the button chops? Like, Eric uh, Moline. Yeah, yeah. Moline. Wow. <laughs> really? Alright. Alright, we got another freshman up. Introduce yourself. I'm Riley Kangas. Alright, Riley. So, first day at camp, who was the most intimidating person on the football team? Could be player, coach, anybody. Nick Newman. Nick Newman. You heard it. Road grader. Alright, uh, introduce yourself. Got another freshman. I'm Graham Gerlach. Okay. Alright, so, coming into your freshman year, who is the most intimidating person on our team? Um, I would definitely have to say Octavius. Octavius. Octavius All, right. All right. Any reason? Any reason? Uh, he's, he's a big dude for how small he is. If that makes sense. Not really, but okay. All right. Another one up. Introduce yourself. I'm uh, Cooper Matter. Cooper Matter. So, coming in first day of camp, who is the most intimidating player on our team? Could be player or coach. Uh, most intimidating. There's this guy named Robbie Alston. He's, he's a beast. He's a beast of an athlete, but. You know, he can be intimidating at times, but he's a good guy, so. I don't know if that's good or bad, but I'll take it, I guess. I don't know. I'm a friendly guy, though. I'm friendly. Whatever. All right. Introduce yourself. My name is AJ Locke. I'm a freshman from Chicago, Illinois. Okay, from Chicago. All right. So freshman year, you come in. Who is the most intimidating person or, or coach on our team? Probably Octavius. He's so big, very aggressive. Common dude. answer. Common answer. Yeah. Very aggressive. Very intimidating. All right. We got another one of the boys here. Introduce yourself. Hayden Sanders. Hayden Sanders, a little monotone voice, but it's all good. Anyways, first day of fall camp, when you showed up, who was the most intimidating player or coach here on our team? All you. Actually? Yeah. Dude, that's the second one. I'm a nice guy, though. Yeah, just because I knew who you were. I guess, I guess. Well, OK, we'll go with that. Well, appreciate you. Yeah. Yep. So I'm here with Eric Moline, who uh, apparently, somehow, is one of the most intimidating people on our football team. No shot. Just Des despite his height, but <laughs> um, apparently he had some mutton chops coming in. I think they're on the the photo for yeah. this year. Go look at the Go Johnny website. Yeah, You'll see looked, some beautiful chops. Looked more like a, a prospector than t uh, intimidating to me. But uh, what do you think about it? I mean. I'm just trying to live my best life, man. Not really thinking too much about it. Not trying to be intimidating, but if that's what happens, that's what happens, you know? I mean, that's their problem, not mine. So you are gonna be an elementary school teacher. Are you concerned that the children will be scared of you? No, because I won't ever wear mutton chops in school. That's more of just, you know, team thing, you know? Don't wanna, don't wanna freak kids out, but I mean, again, that's their problem if they're freaked out, you know? Can't really help that. Fair enough, fair enough. 